from tips and strategies to success stories and expert insights get ready to uncover everything you need to know about bitsat 2024 and pave your way to a bright future in engineering we have the bits pilani campus and then bits pilani kk birla goa campus and bits pilani hyderabad campus these three campuses are there and you can see the uh, branches of course mainly we deal for computer science electrics and electronics electronics and uh, instrumentation and then we have electronics and communication and then this mathematics and computing and especially for computer science civil and chemical these branches we have at tilani and uh, then another same thing almost for uh, kk birla goa campus also and for hyderabad campus also we have the same same branches the above the bottom part is for masters so those who are planning for a masters there they also can appear for the same exam examination is same and uh, then i would tell you the pitsa test format how it does so basically this exam will take uh, this exam would be conducted into the four parts so the first part would be your usual physics the second part would be chemistry and part 3 will be to check your english proficiency and the logical reasoning and the logical reasoning and then part 4 will be especially mathematics so yeah uh, mentioned is biology also those who are appearing for free farm like those who want to um, do pharmacy from this from the bits they can they have to appear for biology and rest of the candidates will appear for mathematics okay so actually you have your pcm apart from your pcm you have your english language and logical reasoning test which is a bit means are another uh, 10 to 10 to 20 questions are added for that the rest of the part is exactly same as your means preparation you have done almost for jwl so it is very easy for them to get through the bits at they need to study some extra part from uh, other than jwl syllabus but you will be definitely intimated about the syllabus i'll uh, update it please go through it and then talk about the format of questions and marking scheme so here we have got there will be 130 questions total there will be total 130 questions for 390 marks because this time bitset has released the pattern earlier bitset never used to release the pattern but last year onwards they started so the exam is for 390 marks and uh, this exam is completely mcq not like our jwl where you have you will have five numericals we don't have something nothing like that all 130 questions in 180 minutes okay so it's a 3 hour test so basically this exam is more about the accuracy and the speed okay and here is the pattern i'm sharing you could see the understanding the pattern of the test so you could see the part 1 is physics 30 marks part 2 chemistry 30 uh, 30 questions and then part 3 is your english which has 10 questions logical reasoning has 20 questions mathematics has 40 questions that that is the most important part because 120 marks is contributed directly by mathematics okay. and then uh, this total questions are 130 130 questions will be total so this mathematics and biology 40 questions will be for, from maths and 40 questions will be from biology for those who want to appear for b farm they will be uh, attempt all biology questions and and now this uh, i'll intimate about the important note that for the bitsat exam will be conducted into two phases so the first session we have is in the month of uh, june uh, may and then second session is in the month of june so this session this exam will be conducted into two shifts and now they will have two dates also and candidates can choose their center they can choose their slot and their city according to them so this bitsat is conducted all over india so they have they have lot of centers so basically you can get your center in your own city you don't have to travel to any other city so you could see here this is algebra part okay as i already have read out so there was nothing different and then uh, you could see here this mathematical reasoning and uh, this this thing is uh, like it's not about jw that p implies q and all okay the same thing will be there but here they will mix up some things okay you cannot just directly expect they will give you a, a statement and you just need to find out whether it is true or false not such things okay they will have connecting word connecting words okay converse inverse and contrapositive is an important part definitely you can get a question on this 
and then we we have this thing linear inequalities and solution in one variable and two variables also graphical which is not there in jw of course and then we have trigonometry and then two dimensional coordinate geometry entire thing okay here they have written conic sections parabola ellipse and hyperbola and their eccentricity directrices and foci one must be very much aware that questions can be from tangent as well okay and then we have 3d geometry differential calculus and then uh, as you could see this rose theorem and mean value theorem and intermediate value theorem is not in jw from this year onwards but it is there in picture okay so since you already have prepared for jw then it will be good for you if you have not please prepare for this thing so just question chances are high that question might be framed from this because they have to frame 40 questions so it will be uh, majority of the portions will be from if you see then this calculus part plays a key role okay and then ordinary differential equations and integral calculus probability you have vectors you have statistics you have linear programming lpp this is not there in jw but here in the chat you need to prepare separately this thing definitely can be found uh, in ncrt also or you can take help from any uh, standard reference book it's the chapter is quite simple you just need to formulate the linear programming problem and find its optimal solution sometimes okay and then here this part they are saying mathematical uh, modeling is formulation of simple real life problem that means whatever you have studied you will be forming questions based on this thing it will not be just absolutely like uh, this they are saying solution using matrices so it will be quite similar to the one which you have done in application of matrices okay and this calculus thing is basically the application of derivatives things like a man is walking at the speed of five kilometers per hour and all such questions will be framed here that is mathematical modeling it's not something different you need not worry about it okay so here now i would share this thing so you could see the cutoff score here it will mention so from here you can get the idea yeah here it is yeah see they have mentioned already the maximum marks until 2021 was 450 okay now it is 390 last year also it was 390 okay this year also it's going to be 390 so no issue i'll see here this is the cutoff score here they're talking about the pilani campus which is in rajasthan this is considered to be the most premier campus among all the pizza ads but uh, it matters ultimately on you which campus you're joining it is it has nothing to do with the campus all uh, that decides is your zeal your essence and your determination how you're doing it you could have your be civil here they have written 224 let me make it very clear that just by scoring 224 you don't get any chemical it is the cutoff score that means we will participate now so candidates must be there okay this is the last means 224 you need to have to participate for be chemical so you need to score more than 24 because you see even by 35 percent also you you pass your goals but to get get emission you need to score more that's similar to this thing okay so this is just an idea that candidate need to score here and if you see here then biggest task is here you see all the scores are in the range of 250, 270, sometimes 300, but this is CS, computer science is 330, which is why I was telling that 340 score is considered good. You can definitely get admission into it's more than 340 if you have. Okay. Sometimes in rare cases, candidates get, and uh, the most important criteria here to be noted is that there is no reservation in BitSat. It's There is nothing like caste certificate and all, SC, ST, everyone has to get 334 or 340 or 350 so admission is built purely on the merit basis not on any reservation cutoff no support okay you, uh, candidates can go through this thing okay so this cutoff i have taken this is of course not released uh, from the brochure this i have taken from some other media uh, electronics uh, is almost 272 the civil you see it's 213 the cutoff is a bit less for this branch Candidates should not feel that since there is no placement in BEC, well, that's why cutoff score is less. There should be nothing like that. Okay, placements are always there. Many companies are there in BitSat. For this thing, I do not have the exact data of the placements, but because BitSat has not released their mm -hmm. placement uh, statistics, you can refer to their website for the companies visiting them. Definitely, you will definitely get the idea. 